Well, have you heard of all these reports around there, visibility in blizzard conditions in, uh, down to zero, especially out in the open country. We're down to less than a it's block cold, here man. in the uh, Fargo-Moorhead area, and uh, we have a life-threatening situation out there with this blizzard. It's, really cold. it's actually deteriorating as we speak. Our winds are Fargo. gusting now between 40 and 50 miles an hour with heavy snow. Blizzard, 2008. <laughs> Hard to say, but uh, I, I can't believe they could get any worse than they are. But by golly, we've got visibility whiteout conditions here, even at the studio right here in town, as I just looked out a short while ago. And this will continue through the afternoon into the evening with more heavy snow making its way in from the south. Another band of heavy snow extending from uh, just north and northeast of Aberdeen up into North Dakota. And that will move through the Fargo Moorhead area, parts of the southern and central Red River Valley, and a very heavy band of snow sending up across from the uh, Park Rapids, kind of over towards the Grand Rapids, Hibbing, and over towards Duluth. So uh, I would imagine that uh, no uh, no travel out in that area as well, but going any point from uh, Barbara Moorhead right now, whether it's north, south, east, or west, uh, uh, just about impossible out there with the, these visibilities down to zero. And the n uh, next thing, uh, of course, we have these uh, very bitterly cold life-threatening wind chills uh, below 40 below zero and uh, it wouldn't take you long to freeze to death out there today as we're going to continue to see those plummet All through right. the afternoon our temperatures are falling off through the afternoon we're down to 11 below zero with a wind chill at 43 below and whiteout conditions now here in the fargo moorhead area at times and those north winds right now are gusting to well even the little critters are not liking this blizzard if anybody needs to know how bad it is out there it's so bad that even the wild animals do not want to be outside. My husband had come in from outside and at some point um, a weasel had snuck in our door. Uh, earlier this afternoon he came across That's one motorist who was uh, uh, stranded uh, in a cold. snow drift uh, on Highway 10 in Glendon. Uh, the woman was only wearing a, a blue jean uh, jacket and uh, ill-prepared and he said it was as lucky somebody came along because as the wind's out there, Paul, I can vouch for what Lieutenant said there. Uh, it, it literally takes the breath right out of you when you're out there and those winds are so strong and so cold. You wouldn't last very long at all even if you're dressed for the weather if you can't even do that today.